What is going on guys? My name is Ron Bebeck again from Ron Reviews here with another episode of reaction to Kakagoto We XX. I do apologize that this is so late, but it was actually out of my <laughs> my grasp because uh, the translator just took, a, I guess, a day off or something? I don't know. Uh, but the translator uh, that usually does this uh, was about a day late, uh, so I'm reacting to it a day later. Uh, I know that this came out around maybe 2 or 3 in the morning, but I was already, one, asleep, and then I had to go straight to bed. I uh, was straight to work, so I was unable to watch it. But I decided to knock out my two priority shows today, which was Promise Everland and and Gotoba no Hanayome, and I wanted to watch this, so I'm ready to get into more of those crazy gambler faces, as uh, Kakegurui is, and I'm ready to jump into it. Alright guys, so without any further ado, let's jump in to Kakegurui XX episode 5, starting in 3, 2, 1, let's jam. Let me fix that really quickly, sorry. Really? Yumiko's only at number 10. Uh, yeah, she'll- yeah. Number 10? Is that- Only has 9. 15. Close. Oh, yeah, that girl. Twenty one, okay. Respectable number. Yeah, I'm still trying to figure it. I'm still trying to figure it out. Forty. Ooh, Mary. I mean, sorry, Itsuki, sorry. Interesting. Number one's gotta be. Uh, number one's definitely gonna be uh, Kirari. Mary. A hundred and one. Oh, wow. Oh, that, well, I mean, she won that one. Yeah, but still. Really? Wow, I did not expect you, you Mimi, to be back. Vice President? Oh, uh, okay. And number one of Kirari. How many does she have? My guess, 187. One hundred eighty seven. Ah, close enough. Two hundred sixteen chips in one week. I don't know who that is. Purple. Oh. Okay. Not gonna happen.
<laughs> yep. She always snaps, too. She wants to show that she, yeah. Oh man, this is going to be interesting. This is going to be really interesting. So, I'm surprised Yumeko hasn't really fought much. I mean, she's only fought twice in this week. Chi, kidai, ski, kidai. Hmm. Okay, you know what? I take it back. Visually speaking, this is the most um, appealing. In terms of openings, this is the most visually, aesthetically appe appe pleasing. Appeasing. Jesus Christ, I can't talk. It's so good. I can't help but bob my head during this music. Alright, I want to see something good. I want to see some good battling this episode. Yeah, I'm curious who won. Interesting. She just wants to... But no one's going to actually, yeah. That's the biggest thrill. I quit. I think you just pissed her off. That's what you mostly did. You Mimi. I mean, not you Mimi. Sorry, you Miko. Oh, <laughs> it is you Mimi. Okay. You Mimi, you Miko. Got the two mixed up, but it kind of actually worked in my favor in this one. That was only. That was actually a pretty good little arc.
Oh, that's that other idol. Or actress, yeah, yeah. yeah. What she, what I wonder if she's the same way. So she plans on competing. So she just enrolled? Oh, what? Was not expecting that. Whoa. I did not expect that she was oh, not even close. I, I I feel like Itsuki is probably gonna get knocked out. Itsuki is probably the most likely to get knocked out of the race. Out of the three. Because Yumiko is not and I feel like Mary's gonna play a huge part now that she wants to actually try. Smiles. Yep. Two against one? She just wants her to, yeah. Just wants her to notice her. <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah.
<laughs> All right, are they going to be wearing different? I wonder the vice president is going to have is going to support Mary. That's going to be really interesting. <laughs> hmm. I should drink coffee, but I'm probably going to go Sleep after this. It's so weird seeing her like that. What, she needs to be more confident in herself? So there's no way they can tie. But she has to have some type of... She has to have an ace up her slave, especially if she's giving them the reins. <laughs> she's got to be like really, really good. Amazing Grace? How sweet. That's a... Wow. It's actually really good. Holy shit. A wretch like me. Holy shit, Dick. Was that the actual voice actress singing this? That's actually very impressive. The song feels totally different after playing Far Cry 5. She's crying. Yep.
Her radiance is shining through everyone. <laughs> Even Runa. <laughs> Even Runa was like, damn. Yeah, I think you kind of lost this round. I think you lost this round. Even the narrator. <laughs> I yeah, it was just like Throwing it back into the ring. Damn. Yeah, but you're gonna piss off Yumeko doing that. that. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's what she was saying. That's why she was saying. Like, she would be surprised if. Yeah. No, she's gonna get it. Damn! Those dead eyes. Let me see those eyes. <laughs> oh, that's gonna how it's gonna end. Oh, wow. Oh, come on. Damn, I had to say, this and Promised Neverland are, like, the shows that are, like, they know how to get you with that cliffhanger. Oh, man. It's it's so weird, though. Like, it, it's, doing, it's doing a throwback to the first season, like... Oh, man, because I, when I watched this, I at first I was watching it weekly, and then I stopped. Um, so I was able to continue on right afterwards once they released it on Netflix, but I, I can't do it with this. I have to wait until next week for... The, to figure out what's happening and man this is a good episode this was a pretty crazy episode i would come didn't even expect that girl uh um the one that was all creepy was actually her the entire time and we just it makes sense though if you think about it that is a perfect way to disguise your look although if you did look like she did show her purple eyes but i just didn't make that uh those two assumptions all right so let's see this uh preview Okay, episode six is the Hollywood star. Oh man, this is gonna be really good. I feel like ah, uh, this this is a good arc. Man, I, I I realize that a lot of them are having arcs. Like the first episode had an arc technically. The first episode jumped into it immediately with the uh, finger guill guillotine um the guillotine game. Uh, that was episode one, and then it reverted. It went to it, it did a um. Oh crap! What's the name of that? Where um. Go back in time. Anyways, you know what I'm talking about. Um, Mia Res. Where they did Mia Res. 
and uh, they went back and explained how it got to that point in the first, in the second episode, and then fast forwarded back to where it, where the first episode left off. Second, uh, third, third and fourth episode was about the whole gamble and the, <clears throat> the gamble and the poison. And then now this episode and episode six are going to be about the idols and the actresses. Ooh, man. This is good. It's really good. Uh, I just can't wait to see. Okay, so we got to see all the rankings. Um, I still I I'm still have a little bit of suspicions about that butler dude who's obviously voiced by a girl. Ray, I think it was, or something like that. Something like that. But, yeah. There's still a lot of questions that are happening that I'm still trying to piece together in my mind. It's like it's kind of like a thing of Lost. Like if you ever seen the TV show Lost, where you watch an episode, then you have a bunch of different answer, uh, questions, but no new answers. This one, yeah, no, still no answers. Oh, it, 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 the, the, it did answer who that girl was. That girl who was always the, the most mysterious out of all of them. But yeah, all right, guys, that is it for this reaction. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. I'm gonna go sleep now because i'm super tired and i've been up for over 12 hours um thankfully i have tomorrow off until they call me in most likely <laughs> knowing them but yeah uh thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys next time peace